We have the uh, POE 100 foot cables that are gonna be used to power the cameras. This is your NVR power supply and power supply cable. You have a USB mouse that's included in the kit, HDMI cable, and there'll be a network cable that's also included to connect your system to your network. This is where we're going to plug in our power supply. This is where we're going to connect our router, hardwired to the router. Our cameras are going to be connected to the ports on the back of the system here, the PoE ports. The port number that the camera is plugged into will correspond to the channel that it's uh, going to be identified as in the system. You have your USB ports for the mouse or backup device. Your monitor connection, you have HDMI or VGA monitor. And you have audio input and audio outputs. So first we're going to start with uh, connecting our cameras to the system using the included PoE cables and they also include weatherproof caps. We're going to insert the network cable into the port, it'll click, we're going to slide the weatherproof seal over the top of the connection and twist and lock it. And then we're going to tighten the bottom to make sure we have a secure enclosed connection and nice and tight. And the other end of this cable is going to go into the back of our NVR. And we want it to be channel number one, so we're gonna plug it into port number one. So now we're going to connect our system to our display. We're gonna use HDMI because that's the cable that's included. Run this over to our monitor. And plug it. Okay, now we're going to connect the USB mouse to the system. And we're going to connect the system to the network as well. Okay, and now we're going to power the system on. Plug into a surge protector first. Other end into the power supply. And power supply into the back of the NVR. And as the system's booting, the screen may go blank for up to 20 seconds.